Hi folks again to a new video from your channel New Cars Technology. I am Henry and today's video is about the all new Audi A7 Avant. This new version of the A7 Avant could someday make its way to the United States as an elevated all-road model. If you recall last year's Audi A6 e-tron concept, which hinted to an electric version of the company's mid-size car, then the A7 Avant presented today will look familiar. This attractive vehicle suggests a wagon edition of the electric A6 planned in 2024, and it has much of the same design and technology as the earlier A6 e-tron concept, but the extended roof makes it even more appealing to our eyes. The A7 Avant is identical in length to the gas-powered A6 wagon which is now available in the US as a raised all-road variant and a high-performance RS6 Avant but it is wider and 2 inches lower than the hefty RS6. Audi claims a drag coefficient of 0.24. The iconic Audi grille conceals air intakes for cooling the battery or engine radiator, motors, and brakes, as well as air curtains to conduct air smoothly around the vehicle's side. The rear diffuser has more pronounced tunnels to minimize lift than the A7 sedan. The A7 Avant 40 TDI is powered by a turbocharged inline four-cylinder diesel engine. With a fuel consumption of 55 miles per gallon, acceleration of 0 to 62 miles per hour in 8.1 seconds, and a top speed of 153 miles per hour, this engine develops 201 horsepower at 3,750 rpm and 400 newton meter torque at 1,750 rpm. The power is sent to the road through the Audi Quattro system, which features a 7-speed dual-clutch automatic transmission. The Volkswagen Group's scalable PPE platform will underpin the A7 Avant, as well as an electric Porsche Macan and an Audi Q6 e-tron SUV. This new architecture incorporates an 800-volt system with charging capability of up to 270 kilowatts. Audi claims that when connected to a rapid charger, the electric A7 Avant will gain around 186 miles of range in just 10 minutes. Audi states that going from 5% to 80% will take less than 25 minutes. The A7 Avant has a battery capacity of around 100 kWh, with Audi aiming for a range of up to 435 miles on the European WLTP test cycle for the production car. The A7 Avant, like the sedan, has two electric motors producing 469 horsepower and 590 pound-feet of torque. Audi promises that the fastest A7 Avant cars will reach 62 miles per hour in under 4 seconds, and that even entry-level models will reach 62 miles per hour in under 7 seconds. The automobile has air suspension and 22-inch wheels, as well as cameras instead of side-view mirrors, which are still illegal in the United States. The Matrix LED and OLED lighting technology on the A7 Avant, like that of the sedan, allows for a variety of entertaining party tricks. Projectors on the body side greet passengers by casting messages onto the ground beside the vehicle, and they can also project useful messages, such as a warning symbol to oncoming bicycles that someone is going to open the door. Audi claims that when the vehicle is stopped, the projectors can project a video game onto a wall while the passengers play inside. These photos represent around 95% of the production design, and when asked about the wagon's availability in the United States, Audi stated never say never. The business mentioned that variants will be positioned a little bit higher, which presumably refers to riding height and implies a future all-road edition. There may also be a high-performance RS model offered in the United States. The A7 Avant Electroc will be sold alongside the combustion engine A7 when it comes in 2024. Before I wrap up the video, I'd like to invite you to subscribe to the channel and activate the bell in order to receive all of the most recent and exclusive automotive news. If you have any questions, please post them in the comments section. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time.